Here I am on a AC call where on occasion this coil is not cooling correctly, it's freezing up on times, and I'm checking it for a restriction. As you look, you can see somebody chopped off one of the distribution tubes, and then if you look in the drain pan, somebody decided to take one of the tubes and splice it into two of the distribution tubes. Unfortunately, this coil has to freeze evenly when you pull the fan off of it. Right now, I got the fan unenergized, so all I'm doing is running the system with just the compressors running outside, my indoor blowers off. And we're just going to watch and let it freeze up because we want to make sure that the whole coil is going to freeze evenly. If not, this coil is restricted. When I was outside, my pressures looked good, so I didn't look like I had low and like really low pressures but my subcool was out of whack and I just want to see like what's gonna happen here because yes I may have flow through this coil but do I get the correct flow like you can see right there somebody took one of the distribution tubes and chopped it into two that is probably one of the screw-ups I probably who know maybe there's some carbon soot buildup, restricting that pipe from even letting anything flow through it. But you could see, as this starts to ice up now, you can actually see parts of it that are not yet really turning white. Nothing yet at this point. But you can see the ice is starting on some of those distribution tubes. See there's sweat everywhere. You can see the ice on those tubes starting. There are free stats on this coil, which should have prevented this, but that part of the coil is not actually where they're attached. It's not getting cold. Now I have to say this is a voiceover because this video is sitting on my phone. I was about to delete it. But I figured, why not just put this out there and let people see a refrigeration coil. One, that somebody butchered, and two, how I locate that it's a restricted coil by pulling my blower. All of these U-bends here should be frozen. They should be. They shouldn't be freezing unevenly. They all should pretty much be freezing evenly. So, I mean, I got no airflow. And you can see some of them don't even look like they're getting cold. That's a problem with refrigerant flow in this coil. You could even see on the suction part where everything comes back out. Some of them are freezing and some of them are not. But look at the top of the coil right around where my free stats are and you'll see that none of those U-bends at the very end of the coils are getting cold. This unfortunately was butchered by another company. And well, things happen. They probably had a leak in coil and they fixed the leak. They didn't think anything of it. Got by a little bit here and there and now all of a sudden you got this. A coil that's not cooling correctly. I mean, look at the very top two. There's barely even any condensation or anything on them. And then the rest of the U-bends are frozen. Well, thanks for watching. I didn't record no more of this.